people. Hold the hotel back at it again. Another day, another dollar. The great artist known as Eminem has come out and dished Trump and his Trump supporters, except for myself. Now, I'm not going to fire a diss track back, Em. You lucky, because I got some bars on Tuck. I got some bars on Tuck, Eminem. You want to keep talking slick about the Trump supporters? I got some bars on Tuck. Don't let me bring them out the bag. But, this I just want to look at this on a deeper level. Because, uh, this goes to show you how much Hollywood and Hollywood elites. They all work together, like the media, Hollywood, they all work together to mold the American mind. You know what I mean? To uh, push and influence public opinion. This is how, that they, they're all hands on deck is to stop Trump. They are using an all hands on deck philosophy to stop Donald Trump. Yes, indeed they are. Now they brought out Dusted Off Eminem. Haven't heard from Eminem in a few years. And I'm actually an Eminem fan. I respect his ability as an MC. I, mean, I like him. Um, he's not my top five or anything like that. But I mean, if somebody put them in their top five, top ten, I wouldn't, I couldn't argue it. You know what I mean? But, uh, come on, man. M, is it, is it, is it that serious? They dusted off Eminem just to try to get some more additional votes from him. This is how they do. They bring out Mary J. Blige. They have Nicki Minaj who go say some slick shit about uh, Melania, Melania, Beyonce. I'm still waiting for a bigger a Beyonce pop. You know what I mean? She said some stuff, but I didn't. It wasn't groundbreaking. I thought she would just come out, you know what I mean? Just head out in heels, you know what I mean? Head over heels, so to speak. But she uh, keeping it a little sly with her support. Madonna just comes out and says she's offering Bo Giles for Hillary votes. This is amazing. <laughs> and another thing I thought of, man, like... As, as as foul as saying grab the pussy what to me is incredibly fouler is staging a, a quote unquote civil war in Syria and killing hundreds of thousands of people displacing hundreds of thousands of people with your with your proxy armies like the American public is more upset about grabbing the pee than their foreign policy in Syria and the destruction and, and, and the chaos they're causing around the world with their military action and their, and their, their foreign policy. It's amazing to me how you can be mad at one thing and not be mad at the other when the other thing is, is like thousands of times worse you know and you don't hear Eminem rap about that he hasn't rapped about Obama because you can't rap about Obama you can't say anything about him and Michelle because you know the the, the, the sisters is, is, is his guardian you know what I mean but he hasn't said anything like seriously what about that I'm about to make a Facebook post about it man I don't know I'm not trying to upset the normies, man, because the normies, <laughs> the normies, man, get on my goddamn nerves. So I don't know. Anyway, this is Uncle Hotep. I'm signing off, man. I'll talk to y'all later, man. Please hit up my podcast and everything else. Peace. But this, I just want to look at this on a deeper level because uh, This goes to show you how much Hollywood and Hollywood elites, they all work together. Like the media, Hollywood, they all work together to mold the American mind. You know what I mean? To uh, 
push and influence public opinion. This is how that they, they all hands on deck is to stop Trump. They are using an all hands on deck philosophy to stop Donald Trump. Come on, people. Uncle Hotel back at it again. Another day, another dollar. The great artist known as Eminem has come out and dish Trump and his Trump supporters. Sucks for myself. Now I'm not gonna fire a diss track back at him. You lucky, cause I got some bars on Tuck. I got some bars on Tuck, Eminem. You wanna keep talking slick about Trump supporters? I got some bars on Tuck. Don't let me bring him out the bag. Yes, indeed they are. Now they brought out Dusted Off Eminem. Haven't heard from Eminem in a few years. And I'm actually an Eminem fan. I respect his ability as an MC. I mean, I like him. Um, he's not my top five or anything like that. But I mean, if somebody put them in their top five, top ten, I wouldn't, I couldn't argue it. You know what I mean? But uh, come on, man. M, is it is it is it that serious? They dusted off Eminem just to try to. Get some more additional votes from him. This is amazing. <laughs> and then another thing I thought of, man, like as 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 foul as saying "grab the pussy," what to me is incredibly fouler is staging a, a quote-unquote civil war in Syria. And killing hundreds of thousands of people displacing hundreds of thousands of people with your with your proxy armies like the American public this is how to do they bring out Mary J Blige they have Nicki Minaj who go say some slick shit about uh, Melania Melania Beyonce I'm still waiting for a bigger a Beyonce pop you know what I mean she said some stuff but I didn't it wasn't groundbreaking I thought she would just come out you know what I mean just head out in heels you know what I mean head over heels so to speak but she uh keeping it a little sly with her support Madonna just comes out and says she's offering blowjobs for Hillary vote